let's move to the another question from impact of jet. Uh, question says a car with an arrangement of water flow is attached to the wall by spring as shown in the figure below. Okay, there is one car over which a jet is coming which is having velocity 30 meter per second and the die of the jet is 20 mm. The jet is coming and it's going to hit over the car and it's getting deflected by 45 degree. So same velocity with V what is entering with the same velocity now the jet is leaving from the car. Consider the spring constant is given spring constant means K value is given which is nothing but 1.4 kilo Newton per meter. So it says the compression of the spring will be in meter. Obvious but dear when the jet is going to hit over this car it is going to apply some force and obviously the force will be in this direction nothing but in the positive x direction. Okay. So now obviously because of that force the car will start moving in the forward direction and due to this the spring is going to get compressed. So the questioner is going to ask that how much the compression may take place over here. So dear the compression which is going to take place over the spring because of the force that the jet is going to apply over the car. So we will do one thing first we will find out the force which the jet is going to apply over the car. Okay. Now in order to calculate this force dear obviously we need to apply what nothing but the impulse momentum equation. It says nothing but what the force applied by the jet over any body is nothing but equal to the net rate of change in linear momentum of water. That is nothing but equal to initial momentum or momentum at entry minus final momentum or momentum at exit. And we know very well dear that in whichever the direction we are trying to calculate the force we need to calculate the change in momentum in the same direction. So dear here if you see the jet is going to enter over the car here so this will be nothing but entry point corresponding to this the velocity will be what v1 and the jet is going to leave the car here so dear here the point is x2 here the velocity is v2. So dear we need to calculate what the momentum in v direction nothing but x direction so we need to calculate the momentum in the x direction. So at entry the momentum will be nothing but m into v1 okay m I think we can calculate that is nothing but m will be nothing but how much nothing but rho a v1. Now in order to calculate the area the die of the jet is given and velocity is already we know. So this is nothing but momentum at entry minus momentum at exit. So here dear at the exit if you see the jet is going to leave the velocity v2 in which direction nothing but 45 degree. But we want to calculate the momentum in which direction x direction. So we need to take the component of v2 in x direction. So what will be the component then v2 cos 45 degree. So if you calculate the momentum in at exit or final momentum it will be m nothing but m v2 cos 45 degree. Here dear over the plate the velocity is same over the car the velocity is same so we can say v2 is equal to v1. So from this equation dear from this equation we can take m and v1 common because v2 is equal to v1. So it will be 1 minus cos 45 degree. So put the value of m it will be rho a v1 square into 1 minus cos 45. So this is nothing but the force that the jet is going to apply over the car. Okay. Now dear let us calculate the force. Let us calculate the force. Put the value in this equation. So it will be rho will be 1000 into area which is nothing but pi by 4 die of the jet is how much 20 mm so 0 0.02 k square into velocity of jet is how much it is given it is nothing but 30 meter per second so 30 k square into 1 minus cos 45 so dear with this equation we can calculate the force that the jet is going to apply over the plate. So when you calculate this force here this value comes out to be 0 0.0828 kilo Newton. So this is nothing but the force that the jet is going to apply over the car and due to this force the car will move forward and it is going to what compress this spring. So due to this compression only due to this compression only the spring will compact with this x distance that x only we need to calculate. How to calculate it is very easy here this uh, uh, k is nothing but dear what 
f upon x. So, k is given. So, we need to calculate x. So, f is 0 0.0828 divided by spring constant f is given 1.4. So, from here to here, the value of x you will get in what? In nothing but in meter. So, this value comes out to be 0 0.0591 meter or 5.91 centimeter. But in the question here, he has asked the value in what? In what? In meter. So, that is nothing but 0 0.0591 meter. That means the spring is going to compress by 0 0.0591 meter or 5.91 centimeter. Okay, dear. So, those who want to write down the question, they can again pause the screen and write down.